The crucial Niti Aayog meeting is underway in the national capital where the Prime Minister is heading the meet with prominent leaders in the meeting. Prime Minister in fact delivered his opening remarks at the fourth meeting of the Governing Council of the Niti Aayog in Rashtrapati Bhavan Cultural Centre in the national capital welcoming the chief minister and other delegates the prime minister reiterated that the governing council is a platform that can bring about historic change anisha is standing by in fact she joins us right from outside uh, the venue of uh, this uh, meeting of niti aayog right outside the rashtrapati bhavan uh, anisha the prime minister has just spoken he has delivered his uh, initial remarks at this meeting and of course he is outlining what the agenda would be of this day long meeting he talks about this platform being a place with that can bring about historic change he talks about cooperative federalism he is talking about swachh bharat to ayushman bharat to all the other schemes that has been promulgated by his uh, government not a word of course about any of those contentious issues which includes the statehood demand of delhi and of course the special status for andhra pradesh how do you think the day is going to pan out from here Well, the meeting has started, Megha, with the Prime Minister's remarks have been uh, completed. Uh, Andhra CM uh, Chandra Babu Naidu has also given his speech talking about uh, the economic growth uh, of his state and the, uh, the question of growth in his state. The, every Chief Minister in, uh, at the meeting is now going to be giving their remarks with regard to their uh, states. Uh, and all of this is going to continue uh, uh, even as the Prime Minister in his speech has said that he wants cooperation. operative federalism he wants all the state governments to work together he wa he is looking forward to focusing on health education agriculture and aspirational districts in this uh, in the country he's uh, the prime minister is talking about uh, uh, the fact that cooperate co cooperation between the center and the state is what holds the key to india's growth and progress so with all of these issues all right and, anisha just uh, stay on with uh, us hold your thoughts we also have uh, aditi joining us on the phone line aditi the prime minister has just spoken and of course he has outlined what should be or what according to him will be the agenda of the meeting today not a word about the contentious issues is what i was asking anisha to what extent what are you picking up from the sources in the government to what extent is the government willing to allow all of these sticky issues to figure in the meeting today which includes the statehood of delhi and of course the special status of andhra pradesh Well, uh, what makes us they are expecting that the prime minister really will announce something, or there will be any conclusive decision uh, that uh, we can see coming out as a result of the Niti Aayog meeting. It looks highly unlikely that something of that sort is really going to happen. The Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal is not present at that Niti Aayog meeting. The Lieutenant Governor, for sure, is there, but that is also being a question because the Lieutenant Governor of Delhi is not a part of the governing council of uh, the Niti Aayog. So there is a little scope. For anyone to raise the issue of the state could to be accorded uh, to the national capital. Uh, yes, Chandra Babu Naidu and West Bengal Chief Minister Mamata Banerjee and other Chief Minister had decided yesterday that they would be raising such contentious issues with the Prime Minister. But as of now, it hasn't been raised. The Prime Minister, in his opening remarks uh, in the uh, Niti Aayog meeting, has spoken about the economic growth. He has thanked the Chief Ministers for the various policies and the schemes of the government which have been successfully implemented in their respective states. He has also spoken about the New India Mission of 2022 that the Prime Minister has. always spoken about so for now the prime minister really hasn't uh, touched upon the contentious issues which all chief ministers are uh, ready to take up with the prime minister we have to wait and see how really things pan out whether or not the, these key issues these critical issues are going to be are going to be raised as anisha was pointing out chandra babu naidu is already right. making his speech and he will be taking up the issue of the special package that is uh, uh, for his state so uh, we have to wait to the end of the day uh, right. mega See whether there is any right, Aditi, hold your thoughts. In fact, 